Hi, this is Miss K, and welcome to Miss K Gone Coastal. So, we outside today. It's a beautiful fucking day, and we decided to come out here and chop it up with you guys. So, today, I have a little guest. Some of y'all may know who he is, and some of y'all may not know who he is, but I'll let him introduce himself and his little credentials. Remember, y'all, we don't give names of places, and we don't give real names, okay? So, this is T, and he's been the postal service for how long? Uh, 19, going on 20. Damn, yeah, 20 19, years, bro? Going on 20 Damn. Years. Yeah, so, 19, we just decided then to come outside. He drinking. You know, Miss Kane got no drink because, you know, I'm sick still. No, but this is that's water? Yeah. Look. I'm just moving on to It's ice water. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's, yeah. it's motherfucking ice water. Mm. But we decided to come and just have a little conversation. You know, postal worker to postal worker. He's been in there longer than I have. He's been many places. And we just want to talk about. The shit going on, just everything going on, the movement, the new places, where he's at, where I'm at. Just, you know, talk about concerns we got going on. So, remember the other day, guys, I told you about the new SDC, about how they're hiring, they're training. But where T is, <clears throat> excuse me, he's at another facility that's allegedly closed, but it's not closed. And they're doing a bunch of stuff there. So, T going to tell y'all what's going on. And they actually spending money over there, right? Uh, $58 million. 58 million mm -hmm. remodeling it was, it was an old was that an lndc i think that was an, was LNDC. an old yeah. lndc from back in the days and they converting it to the new thing that they're doing now where they're doing massive massive hiring I mean, is it going to be the rp i don't see is that what they're making you it know what? it's a it's uh from i was watching one of your older videos mm -hmm. and he was talking about how they keep the stuff secretive and stuff. And the joy, yes. the joy had actually has been in the building. He been there. Yeah, a couple oh, weeks ago. Oh shit! Couple, couple weeks ago, mm. they, they was like, yeah, that, 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 that's the joy, and everybody all clenching their booty cheeks up and stuff <laughs> like that. You know how that be and stuff. I just went on about my business, going about my. But regular they, but day. they ain't tell y'all what y'all nah, affiliation like, gonna be. It's, it, they don't tell anybody anything. Keep how, telling y'all that. How I know is cause I know you know like. Mm -hmm. I know people and mm. people who know I know you know they don't I don't talk mm -hmm. but like that I don't talk and I'm good with information and I spread it to the right people mm -hmm. like Miss K you know mm -hmm. how me and Miss K met was off of information and she Correct. was just like wow I didn't know that these things were I'm like oh anytime nah. you want to know something holla and, you the con <laughs> and the connect was and the connect was made through JH mm -hmm. so what so that's how we got that connect mm -hmm. but the funny part is, is that he called me, or well, I called him because I had touched base with him in a while. Because I want to know what's going on in his facility because everything else has been going on. And I literally was driving y'all. And I said, let me call my man T because I haven't heard about his facility. And when he called, when I spoke to him, he telling me about all this hiring, all this equipment coming in. Baby, they fixing bathrooms. See, tell them what they got going on. Oh. Water on every bathroom in the building. Mm. Um, they got a company, they got like six companies in the building at once. We got people up in the ceiling and the rafters mm. with all the, you know, the metal and stuff up there. Mm. They dusting that by hand. They up there through the hole in this big facility. So mm. it it maybe took them about maybe a month to dust by hand the top. Then they're uh, polishing the floors, mm. remodeling, like completely ripping out and remodeling all the bathrooms. Mm. They say they was going to redo the floor, but from what we see now, it's pretty much they just waxing it. They ain't mm. gonna put no new tile or nothing, nothing like that. They're trying to make it look pretty. Yeah, pretty enough that it 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 shot new break room, new break room area and stuff like that, remodel and everything. Now, have you seen the break room at the S? The new I SCC? seen the I seen the, the you picture seen from they uh, got the, ice uh, machines, Jay's bro? video. Yeah, they got ice machines. I, I mean, facilities have had ice machines, but not really. Not it's still a surprise because uh, a former facility that I was at, we had two ice machines they they work when they wanted to and mm -hmm. gotta put my hand up there yeah, somebody gotta clean it because I'm, I'm <laughs> oh yeah they be they be they real nasty. nasty and i used to cut up about that and be like damn ain't nobody so don't gonna... so don't be hollering yeah, y'all on yeah. ice machines and then, ice man, nobody machines gonna, ain't all yeah, that you, you actually have to maintain those <laughs> mm -hmm. because they get sludge and slush in the inside yes. where the water and the and ice nasty, mix, mm, mixes and it slime. be bacteria slime mm. oh man so mm. if you if you know maintenance man holler at them boys and tell them like hey man 
I, I appreciate you know look I, out for yeah. him too look out for my man the soda or something you came back from pizza hut or something like that give me a nice slice of pizza, pizza. <laughs> you know like dog they i mean your maintenance people appreciate it because mm-hmm. you feel me like all they a little pat on the back sometimes will go a long way with you because that custodian lady that custodian man mm-hmm. that mechanic up mm-hmm. under the machine they do a lot of stuff they know stuff beyond <laughs> stuff. They know a they lot stuff of beyond stuff. And stuff. sometimes all you need to do is just spark one conversation with them. Mm-hmm. And literally, they'll, they'll blow your mind. you be like, damn, I ain't even. Yeah, you know all this all the time. That's why they, a lot of them just don't really talk to no, people. They, very, they like, stay to they they themselves yeah. and shit. We all like that because we know a lot of stuff. Mm-hmm. So, and, and But with me, I'm quiet to an extent. And a lot of people, you know, the, the people that know me and that, I know and I, I, I really get along with it. Mm-hmm. I'm going to say it like this. I, can I curse on you? Man, fuck go with, ahead. It's my you know, damn show. people that I fuck with, you know, like, <laughs> and fuck with me. You feel know I me? Mean? Like, so no we, we, you know, I look out for them and we look out for each other. And that's, you know, you got to have a good camaraderie in, 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 in the workplace. Now, T, tell me, where you at, you are a custodian, right? Yeah. Okay. So, what was your workforce of custodians? Cause I know now y'all hiring mm-hmm. and y'all bringing in new custodians. How many? Like twenty? Uh, no, no, in all, in, in all. total, in total twenty, in total just for that facility. For, for that facility. Yeah. So that building, like J H show mm-hmm. or whatever like that, they probably gonna have about. No, no, but you know what? No, no, let me not say that because he said they on the right. The Zambonis, what I call them, the Zambonis. Oh, mm. You get on them and you pretty mm. much ride it like a street sweeper. But they still would need, I would think, for a building of that size. A few of them. You get about three or four of those. Mm-hmm. Man, them things cover, cover, so you, a, cover so, area. So the, would they need 10 or 15 people custodians? I mean, if they, if, they, if they wanted to do it, they mm-hmm. could. You feel me? Because there's some facilities where it's 10, 15 custodians in there. And it's it's they're stretching a lot of work. It's it's always mm-hmm. something for a custodian. To do. That is true. You know what I mean? It's always something. They have a lot of downtime, you, but they do have stuff. You to can do, do stuff, and mm-hmm. like me, I you will see me walk past me. I'm dusting the wall. I'm just standing there dusting the wall. You need to tell the motherfucking hey, custodian that at my man, fucking no, hey, location, dusting the wall. Long as you people, every time people <laughs> see me, they see me doing something. They be like, T man, damn. Do you ever stop working? Nah. I just giggle to myself nah. like, boy, you ain't know. I was just, you know, sitting down from a break. People don't, people don't understand. Chicken you or make, it, like you that. make it look good. You know? You don't, no, but, but, you but do your work job. Yeah. But do your job. You work Our hard. job is to clean up for you, mm-hmm. not after you. Correct. Remember that. Let me repeat that Repeat again. that for, them, for the walls For the you, mm-hmm. not after you. Correct. Because... You run into the wrong custodian, you're having a bad day, Ooh. and you just get up and leave your pizza box there, your, oh, you don't or waste your some soda. Stuff you ain't trying to no, tell no, nobody. Just, just mm-hmm. yeah, if you waste something, just for, hey, hey, boss man, uh, Miss Lady, um, I waste this. I I'm waste sorry. my soda. I was walking through the thing or whatever. Can I? You know, you know what? You know what goes a long way. Offer. I, it's it's not. You know what? It's not your job. Mm-hmm. You ain't gotta really do that. Be like, man, you got some napkins or something I could put over. You know that. You know what that custodian's gonna say? Mm-hmm. Hey, don't even worry about I that. Got I got it. it. I got it. You hear me? It, that that little gesture of kindness right there, of just offering to help that mm-hmm. person clean up the spill. Mm-hmm. That I'll say 85 percent of the time, that custodian is not gonna let you do that. You hear me because he, you know, he's just like, nah, unless man, I got, I, 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 yeah, unless they're an asshole unless or whatever like that, because that's our job, mm-hmm. just, you know, but if you just go in the break room and you bust up the whole break room mm-hmm. and you walk out of there and then Miss Candy, who always walk, I ain't even going to talk about Miss Candy like Don't that. Don't talk about Miss Candy. Miss Candy got some stuff in her, in her uh, coffee that, that, mm. that inhabits her from walking straight. Oh, <laughs> she one of those. We, got to, we still got a couple of those you at my job. No, boy, it, ain't, it ain't even a coffee They be the driving the tow motors, too. They be driving the tow motors. Listen. And listen. the people know. Management know. Everybody Shit, know. manager probably drinking with they you. Can't, yes. They can't do nothing because nobody want to drive. So they have to, even if they hit a wall, they take them off, put them on probation, mm-hmm. and put them right back on the machine. But that's we but see the- at your at your facility though, y'all gotta understand his facility technically was a, a kind of medium sized plant. Yeah, and it was open for quite some time down in Fort Lauderdale. Mm-hmm. And then when all the changes happened in the early nineties, South Florida, Fort Lauderdale, a lot of them closed. People were excessed out. So they lost mail handlers and clerks and stuff. So now their facility is still open in the front. They have customer service. But in the back, which is very big, and I've been there, it's very big. They still do 
nail processing, but it's on a smaller scale. Mm-hmm. And they don't have price. Right now. Right now. Right yeah. now. Right so now. <laughs> prior to last year, right then, it was, was just them. And then you have you have a couple of mail handlers. No, no, no. Y'all had no mail handlers, right? No mail handlers. It's just y'all. It's just clerks. It's just clerks, yeah. Y'all it's had no mail handlers. for the front and clerks for, for the, the back. back. Yes, right. And then the custodians mm-hmm. actually kind of do like mail handler work. They actually drive. The forklifts and tow motors. Yeah, they do. It's allowed there, so don't don't start your shit. Uh, yeah, no, hey, don't hey, start your believe shit. me, we don't want to do it. We do not want to do it, but we're the only certified ones in the building. And sometimes when we come from our facility to theirs to do certain things, we usually well we were, but we don't do it anymore. We will bring a a driver would bring a mail handler with them mm-hmm. to take care of um, the U bomb. And you guys that was last year. They yeah, and then, year. then they stopped that. So because, they sent your boy down there. Yeah, so yeah, good dude too. Good yeah, so, dude. So, so, so yeah, Pipkin. Pipkin was down there. <laughs> we had somebody else that went. He ain't got no job no more. But uh, uh, not Pipkin, somebody uh, uh, else. Uh, but that's what that's how their facility function prior to now. So now you guys are hiring custodians. Uh, so how many carriers. stations? How many carriers are coming? How many stations are coming to y'all? Because y'all uh, they're gonna have what it is in that now. It's like four stations in that now. Net four I, stations. Four stations. How many is supposed to now. totally go there? I think either six to seven. Okay. Six to seven. Because I, I did bring see. about about three more in there. Because I more in there. yeah, because I saw the list of the stations that's closing. Mm-hmm. And I was like, damn, okay. Yeah. It's, it's literally one right down the street uh-huh. from from y'all. All, uh, yes, yeah, that's yes. literally close. Yeah. Straight down the that's street. That's the first, that's yep, the that's next a, one that's yeah. coming. So now you got, y'all going to become a carrier hub mm-hmm. with clerks. Mm-hmm. And uh, y'all get machines too, right? No machines? They got one in there now that uh, it's, uh, no, you know what? It's not even that no more. They, they took that machine. Which the one, the little small bundle S- at the one that you saw? The little small bundle yeah. that, that, that you saw. They took that right small. after you yeah. left. They took that. They took that right after you left? They took that. That's wow. gone. They took that machine. I had to help with the forklift and put it in the, and load it up and help load it up in the truck. And they actually sent the... Uh, so what are they getting? What are they bringing in there now? It, no, it ain't bringing. It's in there. It's uh, up and operational. No. It's a, uh, the machine that's in there now. They're finna bring another one. So it's going to be two of them. Mm. I don't know what... The name of it is, it's not, because the other one was the stud, it's a S-U-S, some, I forget mm-hmm. the name of it. People out there don't know yeah, what you're talking yeah, about. Yeah, I know what he's talking this about. This one, I'm going to tell you, the one they have in there now, I don't know the name of it, I'm going to describe it to you. It looks like an apps, mm-hmm. but you don't have any clerk's key in or anything like that. It's just, it's just the, the drop down, you don't drop down on any sacks. You don't have to pull those things out with the sacks and flip the, flip the knobs and, you know, do your thing. You don't have no, it's all in all cages, all cages. So everything dropping cages. Cage. No, no, no. You know what? Excuse me. I'm mm-hmm, sorry. Mm-hmm. Not even cages no more. They took away. I I had to load those up too. They took away all the cages out of the building. They have brand new, uh, big, uh, those like look like leather cloth blue like hampers, not the orange plastic ones. They got. They ordered from uh. With a uh, U-line, uh-huh. if you got a U-line catalog, look in there. I have a U-line big catalog. Blue, big blue hampers. Big blue hampers with rollers, six six rollers on the bottom, wheels on the bottom, mm-hmm. whatever. Nice ones. They got the, uh, when you put your uh, buckets of mail or mail in there, it's a tray on springs. So the tray goes down oh, to shit. the bottom of the, the bottom of the, uh, excuse me, y'all. To the bottom of the, <laughs> <laughs> to the bottom of the, uh, the, the damn car, excuse mm-hmm. me, I'm, I'm trying to get the car Maybe and, uh, water. yeah, the car and so when they pull all the mail out, the thing comes back up and it's flat to the top of the car. Ooh. So if you got any trash or any, you know, some of y'all like to eat and throw your stuff in wow. your, in your carts and stuff, wow. I have to clean that up too. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that, yeah, nasty. And, and, that's and, 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 and piss bottles too. Y'all need to stop doing that. Stop Who pissing in. Oh, they, 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 oh, they urinate and feces no. in the bags in the LLVs and stuff. And you know where they throw them at when they get back to the station? Right outside the welcome you to welcome to the post it. office. <laughs> they sling, them. They sling them in the grass oh, when I'm cutting the grass. I run over all type of feces and piss nasty. bottles. I'd be like, you niggas. Y'all is that's all. <laughs> listen, y'all that is listen. If y'all a carrier and y'all watching this, drop it in the comments and let me know if y'all either a do this shit 
or people who do it because I didn't know y'all did it. Truck drivers is worse too. They yeah, take off their pampers and put them in bags. Now the, the contract track. drivers, yeah, we know they. <laughs> they they wear pampers. <laughs> yeah, we, they do. Some of them do wear pampers. <laughs> hey, ain't no lie. He, hey, he ain't lying. But, hey, the story. And if you work at a big, if you work at a big plant, you will know. Oh man. They come in there sagging. Oh, they sagging, man. They drop the pamper in the garbage can in the bathroom. So when you go in the bathroom, and you, you like. Smell and it's a bit, and not, not I, the custodian, gotta, clean that, gotta clean that up. So don't tell me my job ain't hard and I don't do nothing when I gotta, I got mm -hmm. feces on the toilet and in the garbage oh, can. Come on, come on. That's, and I, I work at the hospital. Yeah. Like, that's just <laughs> and that's a daily thing. Don't think that don't happen daily. It happens gross. all the time. So but anyway. Are, the, are some of the stations already there yet or not yet? Uh, one is... Another one is coming, if it hasn't came in the past week, it'll mm. be there before the end of the month. Okay. Before the end of the month. And they got that, cases in there already? The machine, no, uh, they have that that uh, station down the street, mm -hmm. what you was talking about, yeah. all their old, no, 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 actually, the new facility, all their stuff actually came to our facility really? to hold because they didn't want, they emptied out that, they had some, you know, they brought some old stuff to that new building, mm -hmm. and they was like, nah, 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 this building is all new, so they had to ship it over to our building to hold it, so they could send it back up the road but to the, another, uh, so to the another stations, like the stations that's coming to y'all, they bring they gonna the be, cases? No, no, they not, yeah, yeah, yeah cases, we already have cases for okay. two more stations just sitting in there waiting on them, been sitting in there for well, at least, half at a year well, waiting look, At least we know the new place is actually using new shit, not, I hate when they say, "Oh, we getting the new bundles machine." And that was just they'll just get some uh, some a machine from like Illinois mm -hmm. that they didn't really use that exactly. long. And they tell the tip in the post office when they say new, yeah, they that mean it's new you. Yeah, it was, it was some fucking place else. Yeah, that's yeah. crazy. Yeah, so they, but they 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 pretty much doing massive hiring of uh, carriers right now. Yeah, I heard some carriers who actually work at stations because a couple of my friends are going to the new SDC. I know mm -hmm. some carriers are going. And they actually called me and said, man, you know anybody who want to work? Because they're hiring for, um, for carriers. And they are hiring MHAs because they may need a couple of those. Mm -hmm. And I was like, why you hiring carriers? It was like, man, because some people quitting. Yeah. Some people yeah, are actually quitting because they don't the want to do it. The, even the people in that's coming in, a lot of new people. They quitting. And y'all know, oh, yeah, you, you know how that go. Jeez. You know how that go. If even you ever been a carrier, job. I've been a carrier before. That's that's yeah. the biggest flip. <laughs> that's the biggest turnaround in the post office. It is. To but it's one of the most lucrative jobs mm -hmm. in the post office, but you gonna work for your money. Yeah, yeah. But I know a lot, I know some, some half-ass carriers, you know, good at hard, but then, you know, they ain't about too much and shit, but the one was making 90K. You know, boy, I done clocked 90K this year, boy. Goddamn, she can't tell me shit. <laughs> it, it, it used to be mail handlers. We used to make top. I remember I was a mail handler. Yeah, too. yeah. I, I remember, remember I was a mail handler. I floated around with, 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 with the money. When the overtime was, when the overtime was, mm, oh yeah, that plentiful. Was, that was before I came plentiful. in. But right when I came in, I had mail handlers. Who were making 160, 170, 180. They used to threaten you. They, yeah. They, not to go home. Yeah. Threaten they were, you. Now they make oh, it you better not go home. You better not. And, like, and, the, and the contracts and stuff wasn't as sturdy as, exactly. they, as they are now. Now these contracts are garbage. Yeah. I and mean, they, well, they back stay, then they, they, they was garbage. But they're a little better. So they think were, about it like that. They, they were garbage, garbage back then and garbage now, now mm -hmm. but they was worse back then. So. <laughs> but you had more opportunity for money. Yeah. See, now they stifle how you make your money. Yes, and, yes. The, the contract the, actually does. The that. contract, yeah. Yes. Not the place itself, but the contract. And also, too, because, like, if you came in when I came in, I came in, like, 2015, that's when they started changing shit. So they wanted mail handlers to tap out, tap out. Oh, yeah. So if you're coming in, you came in from 2015 on, and especially if you're coming in now, mm -hmm. they got y'all capped out. It's yeah. only a certain amount of money we can make. Yeah. At even at high level. Yep. Before 2015, you were working in the 90s, the 80s, oh, the yeah. early 2000s. Hey, baby, over, money was thirty something. Money was free. Your, your <laughs> check would look like you hit the lottery. Yeah. Ask some old timers. Yeah, oh, the old timers. Yeah, the old timers. The old timers in the post office back in the days ran ran the facility. You mm -hmm. know why? They had all the money. Correct. They could pay it. They could pick it. They would come, they come in with a wad like this. They come in with a wad. They paying for hours mm -mm. and the people. Don't, don't tell people that. <laughs> yeah. Don't tell people about the old days. Oh, no, them, them, old, the, them old Wild West days. Man. They come out of days. Oh, they man. can't have the old days. Yeah, yeah. They, they've, they've, uh, 
No. Don't do it. No, they haven't. Don't they, hurt. It's Don't still hurt. it's not the same. It's just not lighter even. now. The it's culture's just, not even the same. It's, it's yeah. not. Yes, yeah, it's, it's lighter. But I mean, because you got a lot of new people and stuff, and a lot of the new people, which is good. Turnover is good because mm. you need sometimes you need new attitudes in there. 